In this tutorial, I'm going to show you a dead simple way to test connectivity between two Linux hosts. If you want more Linux and cloud tutorials like this, please make sure you hit the subscribe button. Now let's get started. We have two hosts, Server 1 and Server 2, both in the same subnet, 10.0.1.10, 10.0.1.11. And we want to verify that Server 1 can connect to Server 2 over port 3260 TCP. So in other words, we want to verify that the firewall is set correctly on server two and that there's nothing in between these hosts preventing that connectivity. And we're doing this before we're implementing a service listening over 3260. 3260 happens to be iSCSI, but you can change this with any port that you like. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to install Netcat. Now I'm on a RHEL 7 system here. So I'm going to use yum install tech y nmap ncat. And now that that's installed, I can go ahead and run it. And so my top screen here is server one and the bottom is server two. And so what we want to do on server two is we want to run netcat. We want to listen on port 3260. So that's now listening. On server one, we're going to use netcat as a client. So we're going to netcat to 10.0.1.11 over port 3260 and it is now connected and you can see as I type things it is appearing here in the bottom. Now that's all fine and good but let's let's try this with a different port. Let's try this with a port that I know is blocked. We'll try it with port 80. We'll do the same thing with port 80 and you can see that we do not have connectivity. It's not a firewall issue. There is actually no connectivity through the switching or the infrastructure, if you will, between server one and server two, it is blocked. It is firewall context off at the routing layer. That wraps up this tip on connectivity testing. Again, if you want more Linux videos like this, please like, comment, and subscribe to our YouTube channel. If you'd like to learn more about networking with Linux, I recommend our Linux networking and troubleshooting course that's on your screen right now. Thanks for watching.